You guys ha gave me a lot to think about. Yeah. But you guys won't get the next one, I swear to you. It's a rock. What? It's just a rock, Sonic. It is just a rock. I don't... <laughs> Honestly, it'd be pretty ingenious if he just... Instead of putting, like, the the Chaos Emeralds in there, he just put, like, a, yeah, a bunch of rocks and colored them. <laughs> we thought they were the Chaos Emeralds. That's pretty smart, Sonic. Yeah. Why Maybe did... a little too smart for some knuckles. Yeah, I guess you're right. No, I don't know. That's seems right of Zally. What? The color rocks and pretend like they're the Emeralds. <laughs> like, it's so plainly obvious not the Chaos... Tails? Why would you do this to me, Tails? I thought we would perfectly plan it together. Alright, Tails. From brick. Yeah. <laughs> it's not even the shape of a Chaos Emerald. Oh my god. Oh, I'm okay. I'm straight busting, Tails. Wait, how many emeralds do we have? Ah, uh, five, I think. Five? Oh, we just need two more? Alright, help me push this, Tails. <laughs> Tails! Tails, you gotta Sorry. keep going! Tails, I thought you worked out! Why would you lie to me like that, Tails? I didn't, I used my tails. What? I didn't work on my arms. Oh. Oh, hey, Tails. <laughs> Tails! Oh, this isn't good, Tails. I don't have a ring. Anything could happen. Oh, oh my god, Tails! Tails, I think you're gonna have to fly me up. Oh, you're not waiting enough for me to catch up. Alright, I'll wait, Tails. Alright, now don't drop me, Tails. No! Seriously, Tails? I didn't know I what was gonna happen. Look, Tails, it's pretty obvious what will happen if you push me into that trampoline. I didn't push you. Oh, you... <laughs> you left without me. Oh, but I got this. You know, I don't need you, Tails. Mm, oh my god. That was way too close. Mm. Alright, Tails. I'm gonna push us through. I hate you. This has nothing to do with me. <laughs> Look, Tails, it doesn't matter. <laughs> That's what you get, Tails. I'm starting to think this is personal. <laughs> it's not personal, Tails. It's just going to it. It's karma, is what they say. Oh, <laughs> son of a. I guess that's karma, right, Sonic? <laughs> <laughs> no! Hey. We're at nine minutes, Tails! We gotta hurry! Oh, freaking crap. Sonic! Just wait, just be patient! Alright, Tails, alright, alright. No, it's I'm too late. I'm gonna, I'm gonna speed. You don't have a We're choice. gonna speed, you have Tails. To speed. Yeah, we have. Alright, Tails, hurry. No, wait, no hurry, 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 Tails. Hurry. You don't have time to wait for Hurry, you. Tails, hurry. Alright, go. Let go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> go. Okay. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Sonic. Sonic! Sonic! I can't believe he ended it off. Look, Tails, you left me no choice. Don't blame this on me, Sonic. I have to blame it on you. It was your fault. We're gonna do this first try. What are you trying to do, Tails? <laughs> I know what you're planning. You don't know anything about me, Sonic. I got this. <laughs> <laughs> I did it for you, Tails. Wait, please wait for me, Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Sonic. I can't see, Tails. <laughs> I can't see. Okay. No. <laughs> Sonic. Don't do it, Sonic. <laughs> no. Hi, Tails. Right, wait. No, it is. You can't make this joke. I can make it. Alright, Tails, here we go. Alright, Sonic. Whoa. Oh. Bye, Sonic. I'm too fast for my own good, Tails. Oh, a checkpoint. Oh, okay. What is what this? What the heck is that? It's like a snowman. Oh, it's like that egg thing you fought in, yeah, in Sonic 2. Oh, well, this is why you fight it, Tails. <laughs> My first day on the job. Maybe yeah. fight this death monster. It's okay, I got it, Tails. Don't trip. Yeah, go in for the final blow, why don't you? <laughs> <laughs> no, Sonic, it's mine. Alright, Tails. Go my ahead. damn. It's mine, Tails. I reluctantly strike a pose. Congratulations on beating Act 1. You scared me. 
I wasn't expecting a voice in my head. What? I'm using this weird radio thing that Eggman has. I've been hearing things, so hearing an actual voice is kind of trippy. What? Don't worry about it. Do you need a doctor? No. Because I know a really good doctor. Eggman isn't really my type of doctor. You, you can't really be uh, picky when it comes to medical help. Yeah, I can, because this doctor is not going to make me feel any better. What do you mean? He's going to kill me. I don't think a uh, doctor is allowed to kill you, so... He's not an actual doctor. Oh, I'm pretty sure he is, though. He's only entitled. And if, huh? they, if it was in the real world, he would lose his medical <clears throat> license. He would never do that, Tails. He said himself that uh, it's illegal to kill someone. That makes sense, but he's done a lot of illegal things. I, nobody would do it if it was illegal, Tails. What? You know Eggman wrote this music? Uh... I don't know. <laughs> well, he did. Huh? He did. Oh, that's cool, I guess. But why are you telling me this? Because only villains would make this music. Then why? It suck. I don't even think that's true. Make the music? <clears throat> yeah. Oh, yeah. Michael, oh, yeah, I guess he... Michael Jackson did. Yeah, you're right. He did tell me something like that. He, he also told me that... He made the music to help his, his robots work harder. They basically match the rhythm of the beat. You know huh, what I'm saying? That's interesting. And he hired the beat just so that they move faster. You know, Eggman has like a weird... Like, it's actually kind of neat how willing he is for his robots. Like, he creates music for them. That's interesting. I he guess probably has more care for his robots than he does actual people. Eggman cares a lot for people, Tails. Like, like who? Like, everyone. He's trying to free the Flickies from your raid. Yeah, I can go for a good Flicky right now. Is that supposed to be Tails? I don't know, I'm just humoring him. <laughs> it's just a really dumb thing to say. I've what never been interested in collecting Flickies. Oh, except... <clears throat> oh, hey! What? But it wasn't as cruel. I used it to power my plane, but it was a equal opportunity. I like the colors of this one. It's oh, not as out in your face. Yeah, it's kind of, it makes it a little hard to see. <laughs> that was what I was going for. Oh, sh Well. I guess it worked. Man. You know, Camouflage for the win. Oh, Tails is up? Oh, he's surely going to fail. He won't even make it to the 100 mark. I'll show you. Watch this. 100 mark. Screw you. I can go better than that. Don't well, I guess I was wrong about you, Tails. Uh, Eggman Gaming. What? It's me, Dr. Eggman! What? Hey! Why are you in my time chamber? I have no idea where I am right now. <laughs> How the fuck did you get here? I I don't know. <laughs> Why is it so empty in here? It's like the abyss. Oh well, yeah, it's the time chamber. I'm able to control all of space and time in here. That's pretty trippy. Well, anyway. not control it, but at least stop it for myself. And the people inside my trials. Huh. That's pretty neat. I've had a little too much exposure to the Chaos Emeralds. Uh, for Knuckles' sake, we've been keeping them safe. I totally haven't been tinkering with them. <laughs> and I think I got a, like, exposure thing going on here. And I got, like, a weird buzz off them. Hmm. I'm, yeah. not, I'm not here right now. That is what happened to the first Flicky. No, Flicky would... Uh get the chaos emerald because it was bright and colorful. And they they collect them all and put them all in their nest. When they collected them all, they it kind of gave them a bit like knowledge. And eventually, with uh, that knowledge, it just kept passing down into their genes. Eventually, be eventually we evolved to the creatures we are today. That's pretty interesting. The shame I probably won't remember what you just said. Where are we again? What my what? time chamber? Uh, Please get out! It's not you, safe for you to how be. How long have you had a time chamber? It's, literally, it's been here since the dawn of time. Literally. You're not that old. I'm not that old, but my you ancestors are. What? You look great for all all of time years old. Thanks, Eggman. Please get out. Where this place going? is sacred, Eggman. You're right. not supposed to be here. It is a secret. I didn't I, know. It was look, here. I said sacred, not secret. You should call them secret zones. Why? Because it's a secret. Look. You have to find them. What? You have to find the secret. How did you find my secret? I don't know. I just, like, I found a... I just, 
I don't know how I got here. Anyway, I'm leaving. Where do I go? It's just, there's nothing here. It's just the abyss. <laughs> For the love of God. <laughs> Where's the door? <laughs> I'll just transport you out myself. Here, follow me. What do you mean? Ah! Alright, he's gone. Is he okay? Uh, I'm sure he'll be fine. He's a, he's Dr. Eggman. He can handle anything. Yeah, for right. sure. Couldn't handle a little bit of. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what he did. He like shoved Eggman into like a. <laughs> a <red. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> that's great. That's canon. Yeah. You know, I never met a cat. Really? How yeah. long have you been on this planet? I mean, all my life. Well, all my life? I have met a couple cats, but like... Son of a bitch. They went to my school, but I, I never really interacted with them. I never really interacted with them. Please, have mercy. <laughs> I never really interacted with a lot of people from my school. They didn't really talk to me. But... Why is that? Well, you see, I'm different. I have two tails. Mm, so, what? That makes me different. How does that make you different? Well, you see, no one really has two tails. I only have one. Huh. Yeah. Wait. Do foxes only have one tail? Yeah. Huh. Have, you, have you never met another fox? Uh, I don't know. I didn't pay much attention to them. You know, like, I've seen them around. I just never noticed that, that the fox... Like, you know, I don't pay attention. Like, uh... Yeah, that is a weird detail to pay attention to. Like, my pee-pee isn't exactly like most mammals. Dude, let's just move forward. This is getting a little too personal. What do you mean? I'm just telling you the, the difference between mammals. Look. Like, maybe your guys' quirk is that you have two tails. I don't know. Right? Not all of us, but... <clears throat> I'm sure we can learn about your... Uh, body another time. We're just getting to know you, after all. Yeah. I don't want the only thought in my head about you is that one, that you're red, and two, that your genitals are probably special in some way. Don't tell me why. <laughs> so let's just keep this mutual for now. It, I guess it is a pretty sensitive topic for someone who's, who, uh, I guess, is genet genetically uh, handicapped. I wouldn't say handicapped. But, but you just said you were bullied for well, it. Well, socially handicapped, maybe, but I'm more so physically adept. Like, if anything, it makes me stronger. Hmm. I guess that makes sense. But everyone hates me for it. Probably because they're jealous. <laughs> uh, that does make sense. <laughs> my... I'm sure if my heritage was still a thing, they would probably be jealous of my... Ooh. my beefy knuckles. Oh, okay. Ooh. Got a little scared there. What? <laughs> Nothing. What do you mean? They're gonna mention your genitals. <laughs> well, why would I talk about my genitals? We all have the same genitals. But like I'm saying, it's different compared to other species. Oh my god. Like, other species don't have the type of genitals I have. That's interesting. Do you pee the same? Huh? Do you pee the same? Do I pee the same? What do you mean? I don't know. Do you just... I don't know. Do you pee... the same? Well, I guess. I don't know. How do, how do you pee? I just pee. <laughs> Yeah, I just pee too. Cool. That's all I need to know, I guess. You know, I just realized something. Up! You guys have been talking non-stop, but, and all this is so numb to me. You guys are talking about the weirdest shit. And this is all so numb to me, I just ignored it. We've been in this time paradox place for like, I don't even know. Time isn't even a thing right now. Yeah. So, I'm not exactly all here right now, Sonic. I think we gotta get out of here. You're saying we should give up on this no, place? No, we gotta win. We can't just give up. I didn't hear Knuckles talk about his genitals just to give up. Mm. I mean, you asked. Look, it's just... What? I did, but you're the one who made me curious, and it's your fault for making me <laughs> curious. So, Tails, how, how would I be able to convince you to give up the passcode to free the Flickies? Um, well first you'd have to convince me that I even stole them to begin with. But oh, you want proof that you that you trapped them in there? Yeah, prove to me that every robot that contains a Flicky doesn't have Eggman's logo on it, and that it's actually me. 
Like I could probably do that. It has mustaches. I don't have a mustache. Well, Eggman only put the logo <laughs> there so that he could tell which one's the ones that he has under his control and which one you don't have on your control anymore. You know what I'm saying? This is very elaborate. What do you mean? You know, like this, this effort of storytelling to convince you. Well, it, it's not really much of a story. It's the truth. Like, he can't lie about the truth. If, and if, if it's very detailed, he obviously isn't lying. I don't know, Eggman's known to make stuff up on the spot. I, I, I seen him cure the Flickies after he freed them from the robot. How did he cure them? He like took them out and then like... Because uh, like in order to free them, you had to like crush the robot. And he crushed it so hard <laughs> that the, the Flicky got injured. No. And so he had to heal it, but... But he, the Flicky wouldn't have gone hurt if he hadn't had to use brute force to open up the, the, the bot. So this is your fault, and I had to stop you. Uh, Sonic, I need to talk to you for a second. What's up? Look, dude, we gotta really step up our game. I can't keep defending myself from this guy. Like, he's got everything covered, and he's starting to convince me. And I know I didn't kidnap no Flickies. <laughs> You're gonna have to help me here. I don't know, Tails. I. The story is way too don't, convinced. Don't you tell me. <laughs> you took me into this. <laughs> don't you pretend like I'm not here. Sorry. I don't know, Tails. Like, uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm starting to rethink life right now. I've known Eggman since, since I was born. And the moment I started like having a conscience, all I knew was to kill Eggman. I don't think you're helping me. That's all, that's all you people think about is bloodshed. Ah, oh, you... You are just proving my point even more. Look, the, the, the point I'm trying to make... Look, you're reading this out of context. There's no other way to... Look! <laughs> okay, look. The point I'm trying to make is I've known him my whole life. Ignore the part where I try. <laughs> I wanted him dead. I still want him dead. Thank but you for clarifying, look, Sonic. Look, Sonic. I am against... Um... Uh, what's it called? The... Uh, Murder? I guess. I mean, I thought that was... It just didn't make sense. Uh, yeah, I guess. Manslaughter. <laughs> I'm against that, uh, Sonic. So, already, your... Your, not, your character is already damaged. I can't really trust you. Okay, look. Look, Knuckles. I know I'm not exactly the most... Uh, I'm not a saint. I'm not saying that I am. I'm just saying that I've known him my whole life. Ignoring the fact that I do want to kill him... I I do know him pretty well, and he isn't the guy you think he is. He is the one that trapped the Flickies. Although, uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to convince you that, that that's true, but I can tell you one thing. By the time we finish this, uh, I will show Robotnik in a robot. <laughs> <laughs> well, sorry. What? I don't... I'll do it to prove a point. <laughs> what? Look, Sonic, hold on, hold what? on. I'm gonna have to take you in another huddle, Sonic. Huh? Do you hear yourself right now? Look, Tails. You gonna if, shove him in a robot? If I shove him in a robot, <laughs> he, he's gonna know that. Like, Eggman's gonna want to be free. Like, he's gonna beg for mercy. <laughs> and and once he will, once I have him in a robot, and he begs to be free. Uh, I'm gonna tell him to tell, tell, to tell the world what he's done, and he has to apologize. <laughs> oh, look, Sonic. Boy, it's a pretty good plan. Hear me out, Sonic. What? Knuckles believes that we pit Flickies in robots, and you're going to put the one person he trusts in a robot <laughs> to prove we don't pit people in robots. <laughs> I just think maybe Eggman's gonna slip up, and he's gonna show his true colors. We just have to wait till that happens. Look, that's look. We need to convince Knuckles now, or else we're gonna have to keep doing these stupid special stages for the rest of my fucking life. I have to listen to him. What do you mean, no, listen to him? No, I can't. What do you mean? About his genitals. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why would you want to listen to that story, Tails? No, I can't. we can't do that, Sonic. Another plan. All right, Tails. I'm not resorting to such madness. It's the chaos energy. It's getting to my head. You're right, Tails. It is making me a little bit more bloodthirsty. 
Alright, Sonic. That is not the effect I thought it would have. What? Look, Tails. She's I'm... making me woozy. I don't know about killing people. Well, I feel like if I if I do something, I can understand, like murder. I think I could get my head straight. You know, that is actually a solid reasoning, Sonic. Yeah. But that's concerning. That's your go-to thing, you know? Uh, another idea to get him to convince Oh, right. Him. You just put him in a cage and tell him... Knuckles? Tell... No, not Knuckles. Eggman. Hmm. <sighs> Any other plan that doesn't involve kidnapping Eggman? We kill him? Son of a biscuit. Like, if we kill him, look, hear me out. I'm hearing you. Hear me out, Tails. I'm listening. If we kill Eggman, all the robots will cease to exist. Well, not really, but like, at some point, uh, Narcos is gonna have to uh, accept the fact that Eggman was in control, because. After we kill all, all the, the, <laughs> all Sorry. the, the like it's, it, it kind of slipped out. I was thinking of flickies, and then I said flickies. It's kind of an old thing, tales. But once we like destroy all the botnicks, Knuckles, even dumb as he is, he's gonna have to be forced to realize that the botnicks are out of production. There's no more being made. You know what I'm saying? That makes sense. But. Yeah, I guess you got a point. Surprisingly, that is a pretty solid idea. Yeah, so all we have to do is kill Eggman. And if we kill someone, it's just going to add to the fuel. So what? You, what do you, we can't put him in a cage. We can't kill him. Okay, maybe we can't put him in a cage. <laughs> you know, oh, you know what? What can we do? Knuckles, Knuckles is, is, against, uh, is against manslaughter, but... He's not against beating someone until they can't move anymore. That is true. Yeah, so all we have to do is beat Eggman until he can't move no more. Until he begs for, for, for forgiveness. Yeah, that actually is a good idea. Yeah, if we do that, then Knuckles will see the light. It's a little sadistic, but you're right. Yeah. Oh yeah, Tails. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> Oh my god, you guys are still here! <laughs> How have you guys not given up yet? The power of friendship has prevailed! You don't see me. Ah! I am one with the chaos control. <laughs> it's called the power of love. No, it really isn't. You know, the power of love usually ends with, with a baby being made. That is not what I had in mind. What? I meant more so like friendship, you know? Yeah, had friends, right? Oh, uh, Eggman's my friend. He's not your friend. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's. But Sonic used to be his friend. Yeah, they were on and off. Hey, we were never friends. Sonic's insecure about uh, his commitment. Not, what? Wait, are you talking about me or Eggman? You. Me? What do you mean? Well, I guess both ways. Anyway, <sighs> it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter, because it's not true. Don't you guys have any honor? Like, just just take the loss. <laughs> Never. Honestly, at this point, you guys are so determined that I, I'm tempted to just give it to you. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> but that's more out of, like, pity. I'll take it. <laughs> no, Tails. We will never betray our dignity like that. I'll take it. Look, Tails. What is it, Sonic? Screw Knuckles' offer. It, it wasn't really an offer. I was just saying that I am tempted, but I, it'll never happen. Please. I'll take it. Please just... <laughs> please just give up. Never! Tails. Friendship! This is it, Sonic. I can feel it in my bones. Enough to make your system low. No more of that. I what? don't like that. It's Wait. annoying, Sonic. What? What's annoying? The stupid song. <laughs> it wasn't even me who said it. I know, I realize that. <laughs> but I'm blaming you because you're Why? the one who brought it up. Look, I guess. I brought it up once. You said it like seven times. Look, I said it like once. Maybe you don't remember because of the stupid chaos energy. Look. You said it like seven times. I Look, Tails. The power of a gem! <laughs> we can't be tainted with anger. <laughs> It'll ruin our chances. Yeah, you're right, Tails. We can't get tilted. I'm, yeah. What? Tilted? Yeah. Go on, Sonic. Tell him. Tilted? It's when... It's when you... You're overcome with, like... 
anger that you throw the game. Like you're not you're not in anymore and you like like your head isn't in the game anymore. Like it's you're ready to throw it throw it away, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Sonic, you tell. <coughs> you that, tell! That was pretty what? Sonic the Hedgehog for the Wii. <laughs> <laughs> this is it. I'm done. Yeah. I'm gonna succeed. Yeah. I'm gonna do it. Yeah, yeah. I will pass this game. Oh, yeah. Cause I am God. Oh no, that's not true. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's true, Tails. I don't think you're helping our case, Sonic. Uh, yeah. As far as I know, uh, the God disappeared a very, very long time ago. Wait, what? Yeah. Look, like, there, there is no God anymore, Sonic. It's he's dead. Oh, well, look, I'm right here. How could you deny me? Come on, Tails. I gotta concentrate real quick. All right. I'm so close. I can taste it. What? I'll just talk to Knuckles. What about? I don't know. Sonic's too busy to talk, so I'll just talk to you. Alright, what do you want to talk about? How you guys will never pass this and you should just give up? Oh! <laughs> Yeah. I was so close, Can't Tails! Do this anymore. Tails! Oh, I was so close! Tails, Tails, I had one more! I needed one more! Is your friend okay? The power of friendship! <laughs> no! 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 <laughs> Alright, give it to me, Tails! I got this! Alright, Sonic. I'll prove that I'm a god once and for all. <laughs> That's what help, I guess. This is it, Tails. I'm gonna do it! I just need four more! Wow, Sonic, I... Not that I doubted you, but... It's just a little surreal. I know where those last four... <gasps> Sonic! Yeah! Yes! I did it, Tails! No Sonic, freaking way! You did it, you son you, of a gun. It looks like Knuckles. It may, be <laughs> it may have taken you 300 years, but... It actually took us no time at all. Yeah. Damn, that Sonic's always taking my emeralds. You should hit the subscribe button so you don't miss me decking Sonic across the face next time I see his narcissistic ass. Hit the bell so you get notified when I do. Alright, now where is that bastard?